Folks, Bulldog basketball fans, another tough loss for Mississippi State. Obviously had a five-game winning streak coming in tonight and really needed this win against Kentucky. Uh, it wasn't a do-or-die situation for them. Still five games left in the regular season, but it hurts because you feel like this was one they could have won. Uh, Kentucky was out a couple key players, but, uh, boy, they dominated Mississippi State on the glass, and uh, State just could never get over that hump after the 18-2 run by Kentucky in the second half. But looking ahead, State still has control of their own destiny. Uh, still got five regular season games left, two at home, three on the road, and there's still some good opportunities there. Obviously, State has to take care of business Saturday at Ole Miss. That is the lowest or highest net team they have left to play. You have to win that game. It's going to be a quad two game on the road. Uh, that is a do or die game for Mississippi State when you break down what they have to get done. Still think that nine and nine in the SEC gets Mississippi State in the NCAA tournament. Uh, you finish eight and 10 in the SEC, you're probably gonna have to win at least two games in the SEC tournament. But again, there's some good opportunities left. After Ole Miss Saturday, Mississippi State stays on the road. They go to Missouri next Wednesday. That will be a quad one game on the road. Obviously they handle Missouri here at the hump not long ago uh, will be tougher on the road, obviously, but that's the game that Mississippi State can get another quad one victory. After the Missouri game, they come back home to the Humphrey Coliseum and play Texas A&M. And looking at Texas A&M, who beat Arkansas tonight, that could very well be a quad one game, quad one game for Mississippi State too. Uh, Texas A&M, I think they entered the day at 32 or 33 on the net. Uh, with that win over Arkansas, they very well could be in the top 30 before Mississippi State plays them next Saturday. Then you look at the final week, Mississippi State closes out the regular season at home against South Carolina. That is a must win. Uh, that, that will be a quad two game, a game that Mississippi State would have to win to keep their tournament hopes alive. And then a lot could be riding on that final game at Vanderbilt. And I don't think it's out of question with the way Vanderbilt's playing that that could possibly be a quad one game. Vanderbilt entered the night at 88 in the net. They would have to get to 75 for that to be a quad one game on the road. That's very doable, especially the way Vanderbilt's playing. And obviously we have two weeks left, but uh, bottom line, State let one slip away tonight that they could have had. They could have made their road easier. They have to win four of the last five to, to keep those NCAA tournaments, I hope, alive. And obviously that, that next scenario, takes you to Oxford on Saturday, a, a rivalry game that Mississippi State has to win uh, in order to keep hopes alive. But Chris Jans mentioned tonight, it's gonna be a game by game basis. He knows his team's gonna give effort and gonna come out fighting and scratching and clawing against Ole Miss. And from here on out, they just got to make plays down the stretch to put themselves in the NCAA tournament.